Alright, welcome back. Uh, there's a few things we can do in here before we enter Cosmos Canyon. Uh, the first is you want to fight these little frog monsters. You don't have to have that giant lizard there. But uh, there's a new enemy skill we can learn from them, which we're going to use later on. And it might take a while to get because we want to get them to use frog song on us. There we go. And I think it uses it on someone without enemy skill. Or not. So, yep, there's a new enemy skill for you, Frog Song. And what it does is it turns your enemies into frogs. <laughs> Which we're going to use in the Wu Tai Village when we go into a dungeon and fight some giant spiders that makes them a whole lot easier. As you might notice, you don't do as much damage when you're a frog either. And Frog Song, if an enemy isn't, uh, doesn't turn into a frog or he has a, I don't know, what's the word, weakness or, you know, doesn't turn into a frog, he can still be put to sleep by this. So, that's really useful. And they used it on someone that didn't have, uh, frog song, so I just cut it out. So I used on the second person with enemy skill. So now both my enemy skills have frog song, and we can move on to find Red Thirteen looking for his grandpa. And, and we find out his real name is Nanaki, I think is how you pronounce it. And there's a few weapons we can buy here. Uh, we want to buy all of these weapons. And the only weapon that we don't want to buy is um, the Silver Barrette because, well, we already have something way stronger. Or no, I think we did want to buy the Silver Barrette for Red 13. We will get something way stronger at the end of this. And just sell all your useless material you're never going to use. And there's a fourth Turtle Paradise here on the weapons kind of window and the fifth one is also in this village so I'm just gonna run over there and read that really quick <clears throat> it's in kind of this hotel room place here's the fifth turtles paradise poster all right now we can continue on with our story to save the world And <clears throat> right now we're just going to go follow Red 13 looking for the him and his grandpa. I went in the wrong door there, so yeah, that was the thought that led somewhere. But there's nothing interesting in that place. This is probably my favorite music in the game. It's the Cosmos Canyon theme. So after you find him, I just went out, uh, rearranged my party a little and stuff. I'll be rearranging him again because it doesn't really matter. And after you talk to him, or, well, after you, you talk to him and then leave, I just left and rearranged my party and came back because I thought there was something, but we have to... Uh, go find Red 13, I think. Oh, there's a lot of places in here that lead to not obvious places. Oh, what are we doing? Um, I think we're just finding Red 13. Or no, we might be going down to sit around a campfire with our party. Yeah, that's what we're doing. We're going to the campfire. <clears throat> Just sit around with everyone, roast marshmallows. And once you're done talking to everyone, for my party I picked Eris and Red 13. Now we can go visit the light show. 
And uh, before we do any of that, there's a um, battle at Fort Condor that I'm going to go fight. And for my materia, I have Chocobo Lure, All on Cloud, Manipulate, Shiva, Cover, and Restore All. And for Red 13, I have Restore All. Enemy skill and if for elemental because there's an enemy that uses fire attacks. For Eris, I have enemy skill, long range, and restore all so I can put her in the back row. <clears throat> so now we can go talk to Bugadin or Bug Hayden whatever his name is you go into the dungeons and that's pretty much it for this video just follow Boogadun and good luck